Hey there guys and welcome back. In the following video I wanted to talk to you about CarBridge. So I've been using this app for quite a while now in the last few weeks and I must say that I absolutely love it. And also I wanted uh, uh, to bridge any uh, app from my phone to my car system and CarBridge is ideal for this. So if you are interested in CarBridge guys make sure you watch this video until the end and without wasting any more time let's get right into it. Okay guys, so I've got CarBridge on my phone as you can see. In order to start using it, first we have to follow a few steps. Head over to your settings, then go to apps, search for app store. Okay, then go all the way down and make sure that the offload unused apps is turned off. This is key. After you've done this, uh, search for Safari. Go all the way down, go to advanced and make sure that the JavaScript is turned on. This is important. After you've done this, Head over to your browser and type in tweakmate.com. Okay, guys, so tweakmate.com. And now once you're here, use the search bar and type in car bridge. And you will see right here car bridge mod. Press on it. Now press install. And it will start installing this mod on your iOS or Android, depending on what you are using. And guys, I cannot vouch enough for Tweakmate. They've been nothing short of great at providing different tweak tabs which are not available on the App Store and the best part is that so far none of them have been revoked which is a huge plus. Okay, so let's give it a few more seconds here. Okay, now press allow, close. Go back to your settings, then uh, head over to uh, General, VPN and Device Management, and you will see right here CarBridge Mod, press on it, now press Install, type in your passcode, and uh, voila guys, now you will have it on your home screen. What you need to do right now is open up the app, and then you will be redirected to a page with a list of offers. Make sure that you follow the instructions correctly and complete at least three offers. Some of them are apps, some of them are offers, but do make sure that you follow the instructions correctly for each and every one of them. I've already done this and it took me like a couple of minutes. After this, just uh, restart your phone and then you should be able to use uh, CarBridge uh, and bridge any app from your phone to your car system. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video, and I'll see you guys very soon again with another banger video. Peace.